Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. It is a new release week for Blu-ray and 4K Ultra HD. So here is what's coming out in stores and online for March 21st, 2023. Don't forget to use the Amazon affiliate link in the comments section below if you're interested in any of these titles. Director Damien Chazelle's Babylon is making its way to physical media on Tuesday, and it will be getting a standard Blu-ray edition available locally and online. And of course, a 4K slipcover and a non-exclusive 4K steelbook edition are also going to be in stores. The much-requested fantasy epic Dragon Slayer is making its way to both Blu-ray and 4K. Both standard editions will be available locally in stores. Also, a non-exclusive 4K steelbook edition will be in stores and at various online retailers. And here we are, the last week of the individual Rocky films on 4K as Rocky IV will be making its way to Best Buys in an exclusive Steelbook edition only available at that location. The unrated edition of Megan is making its way to Blu-ray this week from Universal. I was really hoping for a 4K edition. I suspect Shout Factory will put this one out eventually. But in the meantime, you can pick up the Blu-ray on Tuesday. The standard edition of Jujutsu Kaisen Zero Blu-ray will be available at online retailers and locally. And Best Buy will have an exclusive Steelbook edition also in their stores. For you Star Trek fans out there, Season 1 of Strange New Worlds is coming to Blu-ray this week. A standard release as well as a non-exclusive steelbook will both be available Tuesday. Now for you 4K fans, you may want to hold out because I believe it's on May 16th, the 4K edition will be available. So either way, pick this one up if you're a fan of the series. As part of the Paramount Presents line, director Wes Craven's film Red Eye is coming to 4K this week. It will be available only at online retailers, but maybe you can try your luck at local Walmarts. From Classic Flicks comes the 1954 crime drama The Long Wait, which is getting a 4K release. Lionsgate has a 2022 comedy drama seriously read this week. And from Vertical Entertainment comes the 2022 horror film Lullaby. It says on the cover from the director of Annabelle, I'm not sure why you would want to brag on that. And Well Go USA has a 2022 action film, Legend of Gadakaka. Shout Factory has the 1992 horror comedy Dr. Giggles out on Blu-ray this week. I remember the standee for this film was at my local video store. It seemed like it was there forever. But hey, you know, for Blu-ray fans, you could definitely pick this one up on Tuesday. And Shout Factory also has a 1948 noir film, Sorry, Wrong Number, starring Burt Lancaster. Also from Shaw Factory, the 1990 comedy Crazy People starring Dudley Moore and Daryl Hannah. And Critical Conditions starring the late, great Richard Pryor will be available on Blue. Directed by and starring Kevin Sorbo in Left Behind Rise of the Antichrist is coming to Blu-ray this week. And from 1968, the western The Bell Star Story. Out this week comes the comedy Stanleyville. And from 2000, the romantic drama Suzao River. This Tuesday, we'll also see the 4K release of the horror film Final Exam. Now, as of this recording, this will only be available as part of the website exclusive from Dark Force Entertainment. From Kino Lorber on Tuesday comes the 1942 crime comedy Lucky Jordan. And the sci-fi fantasy film Flaming Ears is also getting a release. Kino will also be releasing a pair of Bob Hope films. From 1939 comes the romantic comedy Never Say Die. And from 1938, Thanks for the Memory. On the TV Blu-ray front this Tuesday, Acorn TV will have Season 10, or Series 10 as they call it in the UK, of Doc Martin. I'm just glad it didn't reach Series 11 because, you know, apparently I seem to have a problem with that. And finally this week, a single release from the Criterion Collection. And with all Criterion, you can pick these up locally at Barnes & Noble and, of course, online retailers such as Amazon. From director David Lynch comes the Blu-ray edition of Inland Empire. As for my own pickups on Tuesday, I've got quite a few things on the buy pile. The Steelbook Edition of Babylon, as well as Dragon Slayer, both on 4K. And of course, the 4K Edition of Red Eye from director Wes Craven. And I will be picking up Rocky IV from Best Buy. I've got to complete the collection, for better or for worse. And even though I mentioned earlier that I'm pretty certain a 4K physical release of Megan is coming down the line, I'm still going to pick up the Blu-ray. I really want to check out the Unrated Edition. And, of course, David Lynch's Inland Empire. I am absolutely going to be adding this to my collection, and I'm very excited to check it out. Don't forget to use the Amazon affiliate links in the comment section below if you're interested in any of these titles. It really does help out the channel. And now I want to hear from you. What releases on Tuesday are you planning to pick up for yourself? 
And finally, a special thank you to my Patreons for your continued support. It is very much appreciated. If you would like to support me through Patreon, I will leave a link in the description of this video. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.